from one end of the city to the other, these 10 teams will embark on a race across Shanghai. On Shanghai Rush, the only goal is to survive. Welcome to China's first high-octane reality show. Teams will feel the pressure as they compete for the ultimate prize, two luxury villas at Gemdel Green World. They'll see a Shanghai they've never seen before, and they'll find out who has what it takes to go all the way. These teams will discover that Shanghai is no ordinary city, and this is more than just a race. Welcome to the first season of Shanghai Rush. Don't get left behind. On the last episode of Shanghai Rush, Richard and Alice returned to form a new Final Four, but the team had a bit of rust to shake off. The Moose crews nearly capsized on the Lupu Bridge. Nick and Liz finally won an episode, thanks to Nick's heroics on the bike. Anna rode too fast in the slow bike race, putting her team in last place. Luckily for the homeless American couple, this wasn't an elimination episode, and Hud and Anna get to keep living the good life at the Hilton Shanghai. Welcome to Huangpu District. This is the historic heart of Shanghai. From the Bunda People Square, in a city that's always changing, there's comfort in knowing that some things are here to stay. The same can't be said for our contestants. By the end of today, we'll know who our final teams are. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host Brian Yang, and this is Shanghai Rush. Shanghai Rush. We start with ten teams from around the world and all walks of life. In each episode, they'll be sent on a race across one of Shanghai's districts as they compete for the grand prize of one year's accommodation in two luxury villas at Gemdel Green World. They must complete each race without mobile phones, internet access, and with only 100 RMB each. Finish first, and you win the episode. Finish last, and you're off the show. Today's district is Huangpu. If you look at this city's past and present, you'll find that Huangpu has always been at the heart of Shanghai. Shanghai was born 400 years ago in what is now called the Old City. Going back to this district's roots means going back to the roots of Shanghai itself. And today, the landmarks in Huangpu are not just traces of history. People's Square and Huangpu's world-famous riverfront are just as alive and popular as they were in the past. The buildings lining the Bund have been renovated and restored. Attracting visitors from around the globe. Today, our contestants will be among those visitors. Our race through Huangpu begins at historic Bund 18. Good morning, contestants. Right now, we're on the Bund. To people all over the world, this is Shanghai. You've seen a lot of this city so far. But now, near the end of your long journey, you've come to the center of it all. There's one more finish line to cross before the final leg. Now, last week we brought back Richard and Alice, but no teams were eliminated. But today, it's double elimination. Today, two teams get the axe. Go to the Bun Promenade to find your first ticket. Are you ready? Go. <laughs> I look at right, you look at left. And it all that helmet moves you past. Okay, well you better walk faster. <laughs> Liz, isn't the promenade that big statue thing, or no? No, a promenade is a walkway. It is. Okay. Well then, let's keep going this way then, huh? Yes. Come on. Each team takes a kite, fly it from the starting line to the Shanghai Expo countdown clock. If the kite falls to the ground, stop and do not proceed until it's airborne again. Oh my God. 
Wahnsinn. Guck mal, ich denke, wir sind Flyer Kai. If the kite falls to the ground, stop and do not proceed until it's airborne again. Your next ticket awaits you at the clock. All right, here, put this in my bag. Okay. It's here. Dang, I think Helmet and Muzi just found one. Oh, they did? Yeah. Dang it. Let's come over there. Last to get it. Uh, each team takes a kite. If the kite falls to the ground, stop and do not proceed until it's airborne again. Don't fall. I got it. I got it. Oh no! Oh, no. Keep keep up. Keep up. Just let it go higher. It's not. Just come on. Can I do it? Yeah, go higher. I think that's the clock over there. Is that the? Yeah, yeah. This is X4. Okay. Yeah. Good. 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 There's the ticket. I see it. Awesome, awesome. Okay. okay, lose the kite. Grab your camera. Go to Nanjing Yi pedestrian chic. Once there, find 10 tourists from 10 different countries and take pictures with each of them. Move, move. There we go, let's let go, let go. Friendly people, but uh, I mean, during the race, it's a different thing. Hey, it's on the ground. How many Muzi? Mind your own business, okay? No way. Mind my own business? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't like it when a game's unfair and there's no point in anyone even doing it. Ah, honey. Come on. How many Muzi are cheaters? Anna, quiet. Yeah, come on. It's just like rallying things up. It's good. I think a lot of times um, people are afraid of me because they think that I'm sleeky and I always have some ideas in my head. Go, go! <laughs> God, how many losers are such f***ing cheers? <laughs> We're almost there. Okay. Okay, so Nanjing don't look over there. Yeah, let's just go. We have to go out and then get a taxi and then get over there. The last one, it's spoken, that is a problem. Yeah, yeah, just do it. Get it, let's go. What does it say? Okay, we made it. My gosh. What are you complaining about? Nothing. Go to Nanjing Donglu, Pedestrian Street. Once there, find 10 tourists from 10 different countries. And 10 tourists from 10 different countries and take pictures with each of them. So easy, we oh, got this. Perfect. From the Bun Promenade, teams go to East Nanjing Road. For more than a century, this pedestrian thoroughfare has thrived as one of the busiest shopping streets in the world. Tens of thousands of visitors flock to this commercial strip every day. Here, teams have to find 10 foreigners from 10 different countries and take a picture with each of them. Sir, are you tourist? Where are you from, sir? Can we just have one picture with you, sir, please? It's, it's part of a, it's part of a, what part of it? Do you think other people took taxis? And take pictures with each of them? I don't know. I just want to see Richard and Alice. <laughs> well, we first need to find how much losing. Uh, Hualan Zhonglu and Nanjing Zhonglu. Thank you. Yeah? Cool. Thank you very much, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, let's do it. No, just one more picture? No. Okay, let's just ask someone else. We gotta speed up. We gotta speed up. Okay. What country are you from? What country are you guys from? Okay, ready? One, two, I'm three. Nice. <laughs> Come on. My gosh. Perfect. Please, please, please. Just one second. Country are you from? What country are you from? Please. I don't want money. Where are you from? Uh, Russia. Russia. Perfect. Argentina. You said Zhongwu, right? Yes. Okay, let's go. He's Chinese. Brazil. Okay, Brazil. Woo! One, two, three. Okay, so that's six, right? Six. Okay, yeah. We need four more. We need four more. All right. I'm from Brazil. Brazil, we already have Brazil. <laughs> what country are you from? Excuse me, sir, from where you are? From Turkey. Turkey. Okay. okay. Yeah, good. Can we make a picture with, make you? A picture with you? Excuse me, do you live in Shanghai? Yes. Okay, uh, no, thank you. Living in Shanghai, we're always asking strangers. Yeah. So I'm actually kind of used to just 
going up to some random person and saying, hey, can you help us out? Be nice, Liz, be nice. Excuse me, are you two from Shanghai? Do you live in Shanghai? It's different when they're like really slow about it. They're like, hmm. <laughs> and we're like, we're in a competition, hurry up. <laughs> Do you live in Shanghai? No? Um, which country are you from? Um, would you mind if we took a picture with you? Come on, Liz. So it's, we have China, Greece, Argentina, Ireland, America, France, what else? What is Please, that? I love the Philippines! Mabuti! Mabuhay! Oh. Mabuhay! Yes, Mabuhay! Can I get our picture with you really fast? Yes. It's also really fun. I mean, I love exploring and seeing the city in this way. And it's crazy and fast, and it's like, I want to appreciate all this, but um, at the same time, it's just fun to be with all the other contestants going crazy. I like it. Hey, hey, hello, hello, hello. Please, wait, wait, wait. From which country you are? There's a strategy to when to ask strangers. Croatia and India. Croatia, how do you Can we, yeah. can we make some pictures from you? you? Yeah. It's about like uh, how you approach someone. The, the way, approach. how they do this. That is right, yeah. Excuse me, can we take a picture with you? No. Oh my God. What? You can stay on your phone. You can stay on the phone, phone. it's no problem. One, two, three. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Okay. Yes. Do we have two more? Iran. Okay. Are we all? That's right. it, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, we're done. That's 10. That's 10. We got to hop on the trolley now. Okay. One, two, three. So now we got all of them, right? Yeah. And then so let's just, uh, well, let's just hit it. We just have to, no, we, we have to I mean, hop on the me. trolley. Yeah. What's up, Dustin's? Hey, guys. Go to the when you finish, hop on the trolley on um, its western starting point. It's over there. Let's get up over here. Let's get up over here. Dang it, we need to pay him more to go faster. Well, Richard and Alice are in here with us. I know, I do not want helmet and Muzi. I understand, uh, like, helmet and Muzi probably rub, like, some of the other teams in the wrong way. But they're a funny couple. Richard and Alice there. Richard, Alice. They're intense, but once you see past that, I mean, I think, you know, you'll rec realize that, you know, they're great people and they're very genuine. Very genuine. Had an Anna also in, you see? Stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down. Okay, Nick and Liz, where they at? There they are, there they are. Okay, we, we gotta hide again. Get down, get down. Okay, That's high. Richard and Alice. They're both on Richard that one. Richard and Alice are on that. No, 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 no. Lisa. Oh. They must wait for the other train. The other train takes a long time. Oh, how many moves you on that one? They are. Yeah, they are. Ni hao. Thank you, Nina. Just at the end of, she's on, or the end of the road. Drinks anyone? It's 6 o'clock somewhere. Head to Cabaret in Bun 6. Drinks anyone? It's 6 o'clock somewhere. Head to the Cabaret in Bun 6. There you're going to put your bartending skills to the test. We uh, okay, to the white hand deal, okay? We to the white hand deal, okay? Hey, I can do bartending. <laughs> and look where we are stopping. <laughs> Perfect, right in front of the ticket. <laughs> Drinks anyone? <gasps> it's six o'clock somewhere. <gasps> Head to Cabaret and Bun Six. There you're going to put your bartending skills to the test. <gasps> oh my god, so much fun. Thank God we are drunk. <laughs> <laughs> From East Nanjing Road, teams are traveling to Cabaret at Bun Six. Hey everyone, I'm here at Cabaret at Bun Six, and we are hanging out with mixologist, barmaster. Nico Adamo. Nico, thanks for joining us here on Shanghai Rush. Thank you to you guys. Does okay. You are going to show us this amazing drink that our contestants are going to have to make, right? Yeah. This cocktail is called the Shanghai Dragon. It's made with uh, black label whiskey, Grand Marnier, sweet and sour, and Angostura. First things you have to do is chill the glass with ice. The glass is a normal martini cup. You have to put two ounces 
of black label whiskey. Bubble to three, four, five. That's my favorite whiskey, by the way. And one ounce of Grand Manier. Bubble to dash of lemon, dash of sugar, and a couple of drops of Augusto to make it bitter because he's a man. This, this is why he's a mixologist. He's a Chinese man. <laughs> you shake energetic. And then you put the drink. That looks amazing. I haven't even tasted it. And then you garnish it with dragon fruit. Ah, Shanghai's favorite dragon fruit. Absolutely. This is for you. Ah, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Mmm. Mmm. That's delicious. It's perfect. Perfect. All right, let's see how our contestants do behind the bar. I'm gonna keep drinking this. Mm. Uh, Kevin, where are you? Hello, guys. Welcome to band number six. I'm gonna teach you how to do a perfect Shanghai Dragon. First things you have to do is take some ice and chill the glass. Okay, we'll get out, we'll get out. We're here, we're here. Okay. We're here. Three dash. What's this? Two dash. Cabaret. Fail. Ooh. Too much whiskey and too much lemon. Okay. Oh, yeah, no. You want that? Okay, ready? Just five seconds. Okay, ready? Okay, ready? Okay, ready? Okay, ready? Okay, Yes. Cabaret. Good color. Okay, thank you. It's killing me. Too much Grand Marnier. Oh. Absolutely. Okay. Too sweet. Okay. It's here, honey. Bomb six. Let's go inside. One, two, three. Good. Oh yeah, I'm shaking. Ooh, looking good. Bank it. <laughs> <laughs> nice and style, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Enough whiskey, taste of Grand Marnier, awesome. little bit sour, that's good. All Thank right. You. Thank you. Awesome. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Please. Yeah. Bye. Let's read it. Let's get some food in you. You made Shalom Bao at the original location of this restaurant. Now you're going to have to eat them. Two steamers mm -hmm. worth. That's 32 Shalom Bao. <laughs> Only one teammate can eat. Oh my god. You must order your dumplings from the first floor of the Nanshang Shalom Bao restaurant in Yu Garden. Wish one of you a pleasant meal. Awesome. Let's go. All right. One, two, three, four, five. A little bit more. A little bit more than that. A little bit more than that. One more, okay. A little bit. So a little bit. So. Two less whiskey, honey. For amateur. Too sweet. Too sweet. Yeah. That was what I failed. Hello. Hey, do you know that guy who wants to eat a Too much Grand Marnier. Failed. Ah, ah, ah. No, 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 no. We're not here. Take us to the front gate. That's good. Pass. Okay, good. Pass. Oh, thank you so much. Welcome. 
Bravo. Thank Bravo. you. Bravo. All right, let's get some food in you. You made Shaolong Bao at the original location of this restaurant. Too much gum on you. <sighs> Finish eating all 32 Shaolong Bao. Wish one of you a pleasant meal. Dude, I'm You're... doing it. You are? Yes. You can do it? Yes, I can do it. From Cabaret, teams go to the Nanshang Steam Bun Restaurant. This is the sister restaurant of the original Jading location, and it's next door to the old city's 500-year-old Yu Garden. Outside the restaurant, crowds of tourists and locals still explore some of the city's oldest sites, but you'll find our teams waiting in line for their next challenge. The line is so long. All right, then let's get in line before everyone else. Hey, you want to go to Nanshan Xia Wong Bao, right? Yes. You are going to go to the it's okay. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Nico. We're going to go to the Yuyuan Hwa Yuan. It's very fast. We're going to do a Explain him. We need to go to the Xiaolong Bao place. We've got to go to Yu Garden. Okay. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Best. Good. <laughs> Thanks. Can I get a ticket? Mm. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank, thank you. you very much. You're welcome. Bye. Let's get some food in you. You made Xiaolong Bao at the original location of this restaurant. Now you are going to have to eat them. What I want you to do is keep counts. Be like, okay, Nick, you have... Ten left. You have ten more. Whoa, it's such a huge line. Is this the end? Yeah. I get excited when we see Nick and Liz. I just like having them around. Here you go, right? Right, Unhinge your jaw and just dump them all in. I'm gonna like be like a snake. Just straight ahead. I'll be in charge of no budding. Okay, I'll be in charge of running in place. Excuse me, excuse me. When we see Helmet and Moosey, we get frustrated. <laughs> we all, they're, we're always either right behind them or they're right behind us. Ni hao. <sighs> Holy cow, man. Chico, Chico. Whoa, was that cutting? Was that cutting? You were in front of us, I think. Okay, yeah. you can go, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao. I must say, when I see Hat and Anna, then I will be a little bit uh, pissed off because they are always uh, catch up in the front of us. I don't know how they do this. Hey guys. Hey, how did you guys get here? Huh? Well, yeah. We took, we took a long right You just have to eat faster. Here's Let my guess. tactic. I take a little bite, I suck out the soup, and then I pop it. Quiet, quiet. They're all Chinese, they know. <laughs> they are so happy now about yeah. this. This guy was normally behind us. And they put yeah. him to the front. Like yeah. we're, we arrived with this guy at the same time and they, he, they just put him in the front. I am hungry. Oh. Put that money back in your pocket or something. Don't, don't lose that, we need that. This is gonna be hot, Liz. Okay, come on. All right, let's go. In the big shot. Oh my God. Really hot. It's okay. So eat long. I'll get the other one, Anna. Don't worry. So hungry, starving. Okay. Get you the sticks. Okay. Thanks. Let's go. Let's go. Food in. More food in. Oh my God. This is a lot, Anna. This is a lot. I don't help. help me. You are slower than Alison Richard and Hot and Anna. Woo. You must eat it. Even drop on the floor, you must eat it. Come on. Mm. Hot. Hot. Mm -hmm. Muzi, don't distract me. Yeah, come on, Muzi. Shut up, Muzi. <laughs> Shut up. Swallow it, swallow it, jump, 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 jump. 
he's like puking or something? I don't know. Just all swallow it in your mouth, like. Say <laughs> that. Come on, you're doing good, Anna. Go. On the bridge. Last one. Put it in your mouth. <laughs> I think they might have found it. Will you be dressing up or dressing down? Head to the fabric market on Lu Jiabang Road. At one of the entrances to the market, you will find a ticket briefing you for your next challenge. Solo, solo, and putting, and we are down, and we're leaving here. How did we miss this? Oh. All right. You're doing awesome. Four more, Anna. Will you be dressing up or dressing down? Head to the fabric market on Lu Jiabang Road. At one of the entrances to the fab to the market, you will find a ticket briefing you for your next challenge. Okay, let's go. All right. Okay, good boy, let's go. Okay. <laughs> you okay? Just puke, just puke it out if you cannot do it. You feel better now? Okay, let's go get the ticket. Okay, last one. Excuse us. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you going to have a heart attack? It was, there was sh all over his face. Yeah, and it was in his hand too. Ew. <sighs> What's too much in the mouth? God, what a nasty disaster. <laughs> At one of the entrance to the market, you will find a ticket briefing you for your next challenge. Okay, let's go to Lu Jiabang Road. From the Nanshang Steam Bun Restaurant, teams go to the Shanghai South Bun Fabric Market. Like a crazy mental patient. <laughs> like a deranged, like a deranged psycho. And, and Muzi's like the nurse that like shows him around and he's got food all over his face. You're looking pretty beastie, but your speed was like really slow. <laughs> it's in his hands. <laughs> <laughs> Man, uh, my hands are too stinky from sure. Don't. <laughs> you puke down your hands and you eat your puke. That's good. Yeah, I don't want to lose anything. He looked defeated. He had like a crazy look in his face. He was just following Muzi, not knowing where he was going. <laughs> All those people around. He is so mad right now, I know it. I cannot believe like Anna is faster than you. She normally is vegetarian. And she's a woman. She was not faster. We're in the bottom, man. Double elimination. It's not looking good right now. No. The day's almost done. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. This challenge should sound familiar. Use the enclosed cash to bargain vendors for a new outfit. Be sure to dress nicely. Afterwards, you're going to the theater. All right. Yeah. Got it. Here we go. What's it say? What's it say? Use the enclosed cash to bargain with vendors Better for a new outfit. outfit. Be sure to dress nicely. Afterwards, you're going to the theater. Two hundred... Three! Three are quiet? Three hundred. Just like, we give you 300 dollars. Uh, we only want to give you two dollars. Yes. If you have a two dollars, I'll give you two dollars. Okay. So, I want this one. Okay. This one. Pat and Anna in front of us. Once you're dressed to impress, head to Shanghai Grand Theater, where you are going to make your <laughs> singing and dancing debut. It's right there. Okay. Oh. I need like a like this. Like this, this, this. Oh, she wants to go. I must go to the theater. I must go to the theater. Nothing for 150, she said. This is good. Hmm. Ha ha ha. 
Thank you. Liz, you need to get something like that. Eva. No, 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 Thank you. And we, when we, I'm trying to, when was I B-side? How much? How much? How much? How much? How much? How much? Oh my god. A hundred E by Kwai. Alright, then take this and just have this shirt. Take a give him two hundred. How about no E by Wu? E by Wu. Perfect. We're both wearing white. That looks good. White with black. Perfect. Okay. Ting bang bang ma. Bang bang ma. Please, we need, please, please, please. We have no money. 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 Theater. I have no idea. Finch, should we change in the car? <laughs> okay, you're talking. This is a Shanghai da. Um. Who is that? Let me want her. There's another one. Let's go. Oh. Well, I feel like I look good. Yeah. And you look good. It's good that we're matching. Yeah. Okay. Getting personal. This time, continue to go, so it's already too late. Okay. Oh my gosh! Look at you. You look so good in ties. I have to admit, we look good. We look like two sausage. I think so. Maybe we can win the prize for the new Bavarian and Chinese sausage. They were showing the dying swan. Yeah, dying sausage. You know, we're looking more like dying sausage, yeah. From the fabric market, teams are heading to the Shanghai Grand Theater at People's Square. It just says, once you're dressed to impress, head to the Shanghai Grand Theater, where you are going to make your singing and dancing debut. Oh, I feel so sick. I'm sorry. Now you have to dance. It'll be okay. I really hope we don't get off, because then I'll be really mad that I ate all those xiao long bao. Let's do it. I don't think we're bad performers. I love performing. We're always performing. Life is one big, one big movie. Teams are clocked in as they enter the theater. There it is, there's the arrow. Oh, sweet. I think it's more nerve-wracking to be in the middle as opposed to be in the lead. It's an even playing field, but it's just how we deal with it, how we break it down and then what we do next. When I see the stage, it's like a magnet for me. I won't go to them and then I won't do something like so. Yeah? We're here on stage at the famous Grand Theater, and I'm joined by Shanghai pop star Huang Ling. Huang Ling, thank you for coming here on Shanghai Rush. Hi, Brian. Hi, 大家好。非常荣幸可以来做客《冲刺上海》这个节目，担任这里非常重要的嘉宾还有评委。那接下来的时间，我一定会做出最公正的评审。You're here today to serve as our special judge. How are you going to judge our contestants on the performance? 那我觉得，虽然这个节目是很轻松又很好玩的，但是呢，我们的点评还是要很公正、很严格。我们一共有三十分的分数，十分表演，十分唱功，还有十分就是看他的整体服装还有造型。所以接下来的时间呢，我一定会很用心、很认真的去评判每一个选手。That sounds very tough. Let's see how our contestants perform on stage. The times our teams were clocked in at will be combined with the score they receive for their final performance. With Huang Ling judging their score, each point shy of a perfect 30 will mean one minute added to a team's time. Michal. Hi, we're Nick and Liz. And we'll be singing Hold On by Wilson Phillips. Okay. All right, one, two, three, go. 
I know this pain. I know this pain. Why do you lock yourself up in these chains? Okay, we've decided to do a tribute to the 80s. I think, I think we're alone now. There doesn't seem to be anyone around. I think we're alone now. The beating of our hearts is the only sound. Hello, everybody. We're going to do a mixed uh, part to show West where I come from and the East where Alice comes from. Ida Sensen. Lee Sensen. Hi, everybody. I'm Muzi. That's Hamut. We're going to put up a little bit of play here. No one can change your life. And we finally got a chance to show the world, you know, what our we do, what we can do, our talent. Step all over you. <laughs> we were just totally ad libbing up there. I don't know what we were doing. And I spent a lot of time learning Chinese dance, and then also um, I like singing. He was doing his dance, and then I came out as a lonely singer and singing my song, and he got attracted by my song. And okay. you hold on for one more day. No survivor stops his prey in the night, and he's watching. To figure out like a routine in one minute, that was really nerve wracking. Of the tiger. <笑>好了 很多音准啊,还不够,不够像一个专业的歌手,所以我希望你们可以继续加油。我给你们的分数可以是二十九分 我觉得可以更有张力，然后可以更夸张、更热情一点，这样反差才比较大一点。所以我给你们的分数是二十八分。谢谢，谢谢。OK，那最后一组我很喜欢，也是很有呃中西结合的感觉。嗯，就会很很
Anna, where are you at? Don't you think we should go up this way? Oh no, that person's got it. Dang. <laughs> Hope you had a good show. Brian is waiting for you on the Dongmen Road Ferry on Dongmen Lu. Dongmen Road Ferry on Dongmen Lu of Changchan Nan Lu. It's hard to get a taxi at this moment. Yeah, of course. Yeah, that's an empty taxi. Go get it. Please, please, come on, please. Ah, f***ing off here. Yeah, someone booked the car. Woo! Alright, go, go, go. Dongmanlu. Dongmanlu, there's no Dongmanlu. It's not in Dongmanlu, it's in Dongmanlu. I don't know. Hey, Shifu. You're free? So we just have to put our energy into him. Right. Okay, let's give him our good thoughts, our good energy. In a day of hunting down foreigners, mixing cocktails, stuffing their faces with Shalom Bao, and performing on stage, it all comes down to one final taxi race. No matter who left the theater first, anything can happen in this final sprint to the finish line. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Don't make him piss. I know, but he's going so effing slow. Take it, sir. Shanghai Rush. Let's go. Hey, guys. Well, I don't think anyone's surprised to see you guys here. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> You guys have proven to be the hungriest, most resourceful, and probably the most fearless couple here on Shanghai Rush. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's right. You've won three episodes. And today, here in Huangpu, it's number four. Woo! <laughs> yeah. No way! You make it to the final episode no one deserves it more. <laughs> you have one day left. Oh man, that is crazy. How do you feel? I feel amazing. This is crazy. I can't believe it. For winning another episode, two sets of skincare products from Canabo Cosmetics. <gasps> cool. Awesome. Congratulations, guys. All right. Fantastic job. Get ready, oh one more episode. Shanghai Rush, you're that close. Thank you so right, much, thanks. see you later. Alice and Richard, here we are at the finish line. You guys proved us right in bringing you back. You finished second today. Oh. You barely missed out on first place, in fact. You made it to the final round. It's okay. Good job, baby. Good job. How do you guys feel? Man, we're beyond words right now. It's speechless. Speechless. You both are a fierce couple, a great team. We look forward to the final episode. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you. you, Brian. Nick and Liz, you guys were the underdogs that kept overachieving. What do you think could have gone better today? I think it was just the last taxi ride. Like, our taxi driver didn't know where the ferry was, so that definitely cost us some time. It breaks my heart to have to tell you this, but we're coming in third on this double elimination day. Unfortunately, you're off Shanghai Rush. Great job. Thanks, Brian. Hi. 
I was. Cold here. Helmet, Muzi. Mm-hmm. Welcome to the finish line. Mm -hmm. Here on the Huangpu River. Mm-hmm. You finished fourth today. Thank you. Congratulations on getting this far in Shanghai Rush. Thank you. You guys have been eliminated. We take oh, it. Eva. Yeah. We're happy we've been so far. Great job, guys. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, for me, so I have proof uh, myself for my age what I can do. It's a lot of things what I haven't done for a long, long time. We're not disappointed to lose. We have come so far in this race and uh, we have proved to everyone how tough we are, how competitive we are, how strong we are. That's all we wanted. This experience, I think Liz and I can grab a lot from this. Like, so many we've met so many people. Friends. Yeah, new friends, which is awesome to have. New experiences. We've seen so many awesome parts of Shanghai that we would have never have seen had not been on the show. I definitely also have like more of a refreshing outlook on yeah. living here. You know, I've we were kind of bored before starting the show, and then this saved our lives. Yeah, it really did. In the season finale of Shanghai Rush. Our last two teams face off in an epic final race, and it starts at the top of Shanghai's tallest skyscraper. They get back on bikes and return to the streets of Pudong. Anna's mood swing doesn't help her team's chances of winning the grand prize. I'm so sick of this. And Richard and Alice prove to be the ultimate match for the homeless couple. The two rivals have one last showdown at Pudong International Airport, where the stakes couldn't be higher.